Before the WIAA boys basketball seedings come out this weekend, there was one more score to settle in the Northeastern Conference. The conference championship on the line is first place Little Shoe plays host to second place Fox Valley Lutheran. The back and forth first half. FBL though creating some separation here. Jackson Pappendorf from downtown puts the Foxes up 19-12. The Mustangs get right back in it. Look at Drew Joten out of nowhere, picks off the pass, takes it the other way for two. It gives Little Shoot a 20-19 lead. That lead is up to three now, but FBL's Adam Lowberger about to get hot. This the second of back-to-back -back triples to tie the game. And just before the half, the Foxes snatch the lead back. It's the big man rim running. Nick Krafsenk with the lay-in. FBL up by two at the break. In the second, that lead is growing. Isaac Knoll from distance puts him up seven. And then it's put away time. Lowberger, their leading scorer, coming up big when it matters most. The Foxes win it 70 to 59. Here's John Miller in Little Shoot. Brandon, you could not have asked for a better back and forth game all night between these two teams. Let's rewind a month ago. Fox Valley Lutheran lost to Little Shoot, but then they rattled off 11 straight wins. And now they're both tied at the top of the conference with one game to go. When we lost them the first time, we thought like, oh, it's over, we just got to battle for playoffs. But Rystown gave us a chance by beating them, and we, we took that opportunity, worked hard every single day. And it, it feels great, it feels amazing. They knocked us off back in January. And, um, you know, so every single night, our conference was on the line as we took the court. And they just continue to work through adversity. And uh, they've responded, they've done a tremendous job responding to each challenge along the way. All I know is this game got me amped up for the upcoming playoffs. But that'll do it from here right now. I'll send it back to you in the studio, Brandon.